Here's what's up, this is Swiffer and today I have a repurposing video for you again and today this is going to be a very very useful hint for you, a, a tip that you can bring with you anywhere for your DIY projects or simply for you to use it as it is. So what we have here today is a USB hub and what I'm going to teach you today is to repurpose a USB hub into a USB charging station. Now we all know that um, lately all mobile devices and all kinds of devices use a USB port to charge the device, be it your iPhone or your Galaxy S4, so on and so forth, you will, you, you will have to use a USB port. Um, sometimes the manufacturer don't even give you a wall plug and uh, this is going to help you a lot. Now, what you will need is a USB hub, a powered USB hub. So how do you know that it is powered? All you have to do for is search for this. Now this is the DC input here and um, if your USB hub has one like that, it simply means that it uh, the circuit within the USB hub itself uh, supports um, an external power input. So to simply find one of such a hub, if you do not have ready, you can head on to eBay and then search for powered USB hub and you will have loads and loads of cheap alternatives which will help. Now what will happen is that what we simply want to do is to um, get the the, the AC-DC adapter and then we're going to plug in and then this will act as a charging station. So if you have a hub, for example, this hub does not come with a uh, AC-DC ad power adapter. Um, all you have to do is to find um, the correct um, specifications and you can have, you can buy off, buy a adapter off eBay itself. So just quick tip, what you will need to have is basically the diameter of this hole, you can use a ruler to estimate. Um, there are standard sizes, so the estimates should be um, correct. And the next thing here is that you have to count the number of ports. Um, this USB hub itself has four ports. So all you have to do is the number of ports times 0 0.5 amps. And that is the um, amount of ampere that the uh, power adapter you have to have. So this is four, so altogether I have I need to have two amps and uh, all power adapters uh, for USB require five volts. So for this, you can see here the specification here. Um, that's basically it. Um, that is five volts and two ampere. So uh, that's all you have to do. And of course the, the connector here. And uh, what you want to do is simply plug it in. And then you plug this into the wall plug and you will have a charging station ready for you to use. Um, that is all really. Um, some other suggestions that you that I would like to give is that, for example, you have some DIY projects where you want to have a charging station, a docking station. Uh, instead of uh, soldering your uh, um, circuit board yourself or buying a circuit board, you can simply get a USB hub like that. And there you go. You have a... Um, place for you to plug in all your USB cables and you will have power. So now I'm just going to show you just quickly um, a video of how it works. Um, um, the USB hub plugged into the wall and then we will move on from there. As you can see here, the light is powered up. I just plugged it into the wall. Sorry that I have to put it vertically like that because um, the wire is not long enough. So uh, you can see the power here. Yeah, I should just show you uh, me plugging it into a phone to show you how it works. All right. And there we go, we have the phone charging. My Galaxy S really dirty. Haven't been using it for quite some time really. There we go, that is all. Um, you have a USB charging station just by using a USB hub. 